The drama never stops, and this time it's the industry's version of yet another stunning pregnancy announcement. Believe me, this one is far from typical rumors that Jibber Williams has abandoned Simon Gadia and entwined herself with none other than Future in secret. As if that weren't crazy enough, there are rumors Jibber that Portia and Future have not only begun a covert romance but are also preparing to have a child together. The radar yes, you did hear correctly. According to reports, Portia Williams is apparently pregnant by Future. Poor Simon Gadia is reportedly breaking down at the news that Portia is having Future's child and his gibber freedom. Everyone is talking about this covert engagement and betrayal, baby, and we have all the juicy facts you need to know what happened before this unexpected turn of events. How did Jabber and the rest of the Future maintain, keeping this secret and what's coming up for Sean Dubadia following this devastating revelation? Gossip enthusiast, hang on to your hats because there are now circulating rumors that Portia Jibber and Future, possibly Porsche and Future, have become engaged. The rumors are that they are going to make their engagement public very soon. Although they haven't made it official yet, many are quite excited about it and are gibber at a huge betrayal of Simon Gia. Mill is spinning with speculation that Porsche, save the day for when I go further into the dating narrative of Porsche and bring you all the juicy details. This is one story you won't want to miss in the future. Gibber, is it true that this drama is hot? may have had a little something going on. Can you imagine the nasty divorce drama that erupted between Porsa and her nearly ex-jabber Simon Goat? Daya is now much more juicy as she plays about with the future honey. I thought we would be done with Simon and Portia by now, but no, this divorce. That wasn't on my bingo card. Did she really have an affair with him? Why would Jabber simply put Future's name out there without providing any proofs to support his claim? The saga is heating up as Simon claims in a new petition that Portia has not submitted the required gibber and has simply disregarded court instructions, refused to provide her required discovery as required by Fulton County gibber knowingly and deliberately breaking this court's February 22, 2024 standing order. Porsche, on the other side, likewise asked that the Pret mandated that Simon leave the $7 million joint mansion, citing the clause in the agreement requiring him to do so until the divorce is final. The court also gave her temporary gibber possession of the residence, and Porsche eventually spilt the beans. The news stories about Simon's suspected immigration fraud and what gibber to be an immediate threat of deportation, which he said shocked and impacted her mental and emotional welfare, were the reason she opted to end things on paper. She added that none of this information was ever given by Simon, even though she had already asked Simon about his criminal record and immigration status, she also stated that after learning about Simon's dubious immigration background and jabber, she began to doubt what she had been told about him, including his immigration status, business operations, and character. Sis was learning a ton of information that Jibber had never shared with her, and she declared that she wasn't attempting to marry a stranger. A few weeks ago, she even made a suggestion about the same subject on her Instagram Happy Wednesday post, asking if it was still legitimate in the gibberess if someone had lied about their criminal history history and used a false ID to obtain a green card. Fallen Peanut revealed some juicy information, claiming that Simon and Portia had been skulking for a whole year prior to jabber their romance and enlisting the help of Dennis. Portia's ex-fiance, Dennis informed me that McKinley was the one who had given her the truth. He said, it feels like he came to me and apologized. We've heard a lot of crazy things, but this one concerning the future is gibber intriguing. I didn't see it coming. Okay. Future's name appeared in Simon's most recent demand, in which he jabbered that Portia had a month to provide all of her answers to 26 questions. Based on all the questions he threw at them in their paperwork, it appears that Simon believes Portia married him for his money and may have been sleeping with other men. Simon inquired about gibber connections to other men. Additionally, she was asked to address a particular question about her relationships with a select disappointment such as Jibber Calvin Alou one-star Dennis McKinley, with whom she had a daughter named Jonathan. Dupont Mix and upcoming a few of these identities had already surfaced when Freedom had Jibber insisted that Portia retain all proof, including correspondence. She shared with Calvin all of the communications that went back and forth between her and Karen McKinney and her sister Jibber Williams. The notification said Portia is further informed that any disappointment for this Jibber might lead to penalties for any destruction or neglect to keep any such evidence, including without restrictions on unfavorable inferences made against the petitioner during the trial, as well as an award of cost and legal fees jabber at the time due to the petitioner's actions. Why he wanted Portia to keep all of her text conversations was never made clear by Simon, but now we know this because of all the names he believes she jibber on him with all those people. Simon Dro, I have to admit that Portia and Mingli have been seen together for a long time. In actuality, over Atlanta Ming just posted a very kind birthday greeting on the gram. She responded, happy jabber at Porsche for real, 
I appreciate you being yourself. You're amazing. Jibber answered, You know I love me some King Ming thank you, but what I want to know is did Simon Mom, a bomb buddy and one of my favorite people, said you know I love me some, actually mean to reveal Porsche that way, because otherwise, why would he have included in his court document that he thought Jibber and Ming Li were having an affair, or, more specifically, in the document where Simon was questioning Porsche regarding the parents, in addition to asking her to spill the beans about whether or not she gibbered their prenuptial agreement was fair, he also included a question about what she understood to be the reasoning for it. It's possible that she hooked up with him. Why did your spouse give you a five-figure monthly stipend during your marriage? He also requested to view her correspondence with the producers and all the information around her return to Real Jabber of Atlanta. In order for him to be aware of the exact amount of money she was making, Simon also informed Portia that she was not permitted to jabber from their married residence at all. Portia was granted possession and the exclusive use of their marital home, presumably as a sign to her that she could use it any way she pleased, including for jibber and shooting. But Simon's legal team returned with a vengeance, requesting that the court refrain from speaking on the matter of taping in the house House creating problems for our R. Jabber OA production. Portia then claimed that it was unjust of Simon to stop her from shooting from the home, claiming that Jabber her time there was essential to her capacity to maintain her income and job. She claimed that Simon had no right or cause to stop her from filming activities at their home, and Jabber further said that the production company behind Roa notified her that they would not move further because of Simon's aggressively litigious behavior, while Jibber her for the program additionally. Portia stated that she believes Simon is attempting to stop her from spilling tea on his personal belongings while they are filming, and she even indicated that she would be willing to skip any scenes that are private to sailors, but when it comes to the mansion, some people are still perplexed as to why Portia wishes to hold Jibber the home Simon purchased before they were even married. Put Portia aside, however, it's difficult for them to accept her claiming Jibber of something he had before to their marriage. Lately, the dispute erupted on social media once more and it all began when Simon made a mysterious post concerning angels and witches, stating that my angel would not have to work so hard if I Jabber allow witches in my life. It was obvious that Simon was attempting to suggest that. Portia, the witch, also enjoyed telling her stories. She concluded by saying and Portia, and then she made the direct suggestion that Simon had erectile gibber dysfunction by posting a screenshot of an article on things you can do to aid with erectile dysfunction, and a dubious Instagram post with many options for men to receive gibber for the illness. Malfunction to begin with if you are overweight, lose weight to quit gibber to eat a nutritious diet to exercise every day, and last, to attempt to manage your stress and worry. Porsche also emphasized the feelings a guy has with it and according to another article following the expiration of the Instagram story post, Porsa continued to post about the dysfunction by sharing a photo with a cowboy hat with the caption at Outlaw. People often experience gibber, irritation, despair, or lack of confidence. Let's just say that Simon took offense at the post and retaliated against Porsche, accusing her of utilizing erectile jabber allegations as the next narrative. He also said in the caption, he intended to sue Jibber speaking in a provocative or slanderous manner has consequences. Gather all of your money you'll need it all to defend. Upcoming events a lady who has a habit of pursuing every ex-boyfriend's manhood by using the same old storylines and techniques regretfully you intended the correct one he Jibber another of his picture Zed's never felt better. Let me take my imaginary self at around the globe as a single man without any ducks and honey. At this point we can just prepare for even more drama. I'm Jibber Porsche closely to see how they'll manage everything. These affair rumors gibber the one about the future are concerning, but he's busy preparing for his tour with Metro Booming, so it's unlikely that he's sleeping well over this whole mess, according to people close to Porsche. We'll have to wait and see if Porsche has anything else to say about this, as well as whether Simon will be appearing in court because she jabber even know what the future holds. Please let me know what you think about Simon's accusation that Jibber was playing around with the future once she has given her explanation. Is there any truth to it, or is it simply more drama? Post your ideas in the comments section below.